Hello everyone, my name is Jimmy, and you're tuning into the Total Drama Special. Well, uh, part of it anyways. I'm here greeted with some of the most infamous Goopalines, Lemmy, Iggy, and Roy. Nice to be here, Jimmy. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Were you granted permission to speak? You don't own us, Roy. And plus, I'm older than you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think it's funny? I'll show you a fist full of funny! Boys! Boys! Please! We don't want any mangled bodies before the season even starts. These boys, if you even want to call them that, need to learn their place. Well, you three were absent in the recent season of Total Drama. So, are you guys excited to be candidates for season two? Excited? I'm pumped. It means a million dollars. There are punching bags named Iggy and Lemmy competing? Then you better believe I'm all in. Hopefully we leave the game with minor injuries. Okay, but we have some fan callers that might make those injuries a little less ouchy. First we have- No, wait, wait. I don't answer people's stupid questions. They're probably all sissy and girly. Says the one wearing pink. Hey, pink is the manliest of colors. And woman's lingerie is the manliest of clothing. What's a laundry? Yep, that one went right over his head. What was that, punk? Okay, here's our first color, built in muscular 25. Yeah, hey Roy, I'm a huge fan of your workout vids and I have to ask, what is your daily diet? That's such a freaking wimpy question. But I'll answer it, because I'm no whip. I start the morning with a few gallons of liquid protein, and then have a glass of solid fiber, bro. Afterwards, if I'm in the mood, which I always am, I have a nerd sandwich courtesy of my dweeb brothers. Then I repeat that routine every six hours, adding red meat here and there for extra protein. Okay, so Lenny J. Koopa, I- Hey, no one ever uses my middle initial. No one! Whoops, don't want to let the cat out of the bag, huh? <laughs> I'm just glad I have a chance to compete again. The million's nice, but living in an ice fort would be better. Better? You are crazy, man! I like to refer to myself as unique. Unique is just a word parents use to make their offspring seem less freakish. Okay, next color, please. I wanted to know, what is your favorite band right now? Hmm, I haven't listened to a lot of music lately. But, I'd have to say the Frozen Warp Whistles. Oh, the Whistles! I heard they're going on tour! Yeah, the Tornado Tour! I can't go though, because I'm still underage for that type of concert. You have to be 21. Apparently they throw Starbuck powder into the crowd. Whoa! Whoa! Stop right there! Sorry. Okay, so Iggy, the middle child and often the most forgotten one. Psh, that's for sure. No one wants him around. Little geekazoid. Chill out, Roy. Your question comes from Can't Count to Waffle. Oh, my question to Iggy, where did your obsession with animals come from? What's your favorite animal? Okay, Iggy, you heard the waffle. Oh, uh, well, I've always loved animals. I've rolled over mostly forests in animal-filled places when I was younger, so it grew on me. And with animals comes my obsession to fuse them into each other. A few years ago, I attempted to make the perfect Paracoomba, but it turned out to be more of a Koopa Goomba cross. I don't know what went wrong. Freaking geek, man. He's killing me. As far as my favorite animal, I'd say Chomps. I have a pet one back at the castle. Mmm, feisty little thing. Okay, so we heard from all of them, and I think that's just about it for the interviews. Aw, that's all? Yep. The viewers got enough information on choosing who they want to compete on Season 2. I was hoping for something more, but I suppose this will suffice for now. If you get on this season, you will not walk out alive. I can promise you that. You say that as if anyone will vote for you to get on the show. Are you? Yeah, Iggy! 